welcome back. This is Permissions Editor. Well, it will be when I open the tools up. We'll open up BPP and we'll go to the Permission Editor. The Permission Editor is how you control your admins or yourself on the server. By default, the owner of the server, the person that uh, sets themselves up in VPP as the first admin, is often termed the super admin. Now, it doesn't actually say at this top that you are a super admin. It just calls everybody admins. But if you select this little button here, if you select this, on the right, it will show you all the uh, abilities that you are allowed as in this group, admins, yeah, uh, all the things you can do. All the way down. The chat uh, options are, uh, are tricky because you have to type in in game uh, various, various things. So it's better to uh, not to have those. By default, they're not selected. Uh, Lots of practice required to actually use the chat chat options. So we won't go into that at the moment. Once selected, you can edit um, the, the list. You can also have an option here. Tribute. This tribute is force name. That means only if you log in with a specific name can you um, use be an admin? So if we select that, if you have a little read, users within the user group will not be able to use the tools if their in-game name is not matching with the name saved within the group. So I'm going to select that, I'm going to choose save. And I'm going to select it again, and I'm going to bring up this edit box. Now, each uh, title, let's call them titles, admin, streamers, whatever you want to call it, need to have a level. And this is level one by default, it's level one. It's for, if you look to the right there, admins, the group name, it's called admins. Now, when you're adding people to the group, they will come with their Steam ID. Um, the title of the uh, group generally created when you're when you're creating the, the group, and I'll show you that. Now let's come back here. I, I don't want to save that. It, it's best not to actually have this for your main admins. Uh, that way, they can change names, come in anonymously. Uh, but for players that you want, like uh, a new admin in training, um, you can actually force them to always have that name, uh, which means that they will always have to be using their proper name in game so people recognise them. But anyway, let's let's assume that you want to uh, uh, create a, another level of admins, and. Um, uh, so we've got an admin low here, and their permission level is 4. There are no players in that group, that's what the 0 is. So, we're going to create a new group, we're going to give them the title of noob admin. So he's just started uh, as an admin today. He's right down the bottom here, there's no players and there's no rank. So we need to give him a rank. To give them a rank, so uh, their permission level is six. Anything below one is fine, it's just a reference point more than anything, it doesn't actually uh, do much, it just gives them a, a basic identifier. The important bit is all the attributes on the right. Now, this set, this set on the right. So, all the uh, tools they can use are on the right. Make sure that 
the correct group is selected. This button here, very important. Make sure that group is selected. You, can't, you can select multiple groups, but it can cause confusion. Work one at a time. The new bad news. When you select it, uh, the, the new group has nothing in it. So you can actually come through and you can put only the thing that you want the new admin to be able to do. And it takes a little while. Uh, you have to come down here and look very carefully at each mission. Um, teleport manager will let the new admin teleport around using that uh, option. You can also, if I can find it, Teleport across here. That's the H button. Now we're not going to let him use H button. We're only going to let him use the teleport manager page, which means that he can't make a mistake and teleport himself into the, into the wide blue yonder. So he can free cam, and he can teleport. So we're going to update the permissions, and that's done. When the player is online. You select the group you want him. So you pre already created the group. The player comes online, we call him Adam. And we select the group, we choose add member, then we select him from here. Like this. And then a new button will appear, add players to group. Click this button and he will be added to the new group. Choose yes. And now he's been added to the new bad bit group. Now, I can't add myself. But you can do it without crashing the server. You can do that. Once the group is created, create the group first, set the permissions, then the player comes online, then you select the group, add the member, choose him from the list, Add selected player to the group, and once selected, he'll be added to this list, and it'll be a number one, and you'll have his name there, his ID number, and that's it really. That's that's permissions. It's so easy to create these these uh, separate permissions. You could have streamers. Let's have a look at streamers. Um, they just got free cam. That's they can use free cam. They can press their uh, hotkey. And go into free cam mode, and they can zoom around um, with um, on the screen, videoing as much as they want. Uh, super admins are cannot be ed edited; uh, they are generally the top level. Um, you just make sure that uh, if you're adding someone to the super admin group, that you give them every permission except for cats. If you don't give them all those permissions, there's not much point being a super admin. Uh, super admin, you can, there are, there are some things you don't really need, like console, server settings, web hooks, those three. You can create a, 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 another group called uh, One Step Down from Super Admin. <laughs> you can call it what you like. And just, just uncheck um, server settings, console, and webhooks. They don't need those. Most admins, most admin, there's only one admin, that's the owner, uh, that needs these things. Uh, most of the time, you won't be using them anyway. And that was an explosion behind me. Uh, that's it for um, Object Builder. Uh, sorry, for Object Builder. Permissions. Permissions Editor. Admins. Thank you very much.